Hi everyone, this is Andres Sara. I'm the director of uh, Rumbo's Artistic Voice Laboratory and I would like to start this video with a question that is, uh, that, uh, which is like a problem that many singers have when they face a melody with uh, two very distant notes with a lower note and then they have to go and jump to a higher note right there. I'm gonna give you some tips for you to really connect and first of all makes you realize that it's not that difficult. Uh, sometimes we, we think that it's more difficult than what actually is. Um, and for you to connect these two notes in an easy way so it sounds the same sound in fluid uh, in a fluid way and also without much effort and for that I'm gonna I'm gonna invite a vocal technique that we use a lot and it's called glissando the glissando what is a glissando pretty much it's a slide it's a slide that happens uh, when you try to connect one note to another note uh, one, a lower note to a higher note or descending to um, without a continuous sound oh, okay it's a kind of like a vocal ornament also that happens in many many songs and different music styles but I can use it as a, as a technical uh, exercise to help you have more uh, have a, a more fluid voice you know that flows better between these two distant notes so what we do for example like I'm um, uh, I'm finding a song, uh, let's say summertime, okay? And there's a moment, uh, there's that, that, that the distance between the two notes makes me, you know, uh, it's, it's hard for me to connect them. For example, but until that mo but until that moment, there is nothing can harm you. But until summertime, but until Okay, so what do we do here? We try to, first of all, you, you isolate the interval that, that you have conflict with and try to uh, find a vowel that is comfortable and for, find a vowel that is comfortable for you to sing the first note. For example, ho, okay, I can choose o, ho, or, uh, ho, okay. I'm gonna try to do a slide slowly to the upper note and then go all the way down, okay? Oh, oh, okay, try to find the speed that allows you to connect fluidly. If you can still not connect, try to use a lower note. Oh, and try to slow the glissando process, okay? Until you find that your voice sounds the same in the two notes, okay? And then you can move forward to the original uh, interval. Okay, and when you start finding it more relaxing, when you realize that it's more achievable, <laughs> Then you incorporate the lyrics. But until that moment, but until okay. So uh, this is this is for you not to to put too much effort and reaching like distant notes. Okay, um, that has worked for me uh, and it has saved me in several occasions when I have to sing a song that, that I have to face with this kind of intervals. And actually, you you start feeling more relaxed. Uh, um, first, taking away the music, the, the rhythmic part, musical part, and just work the sound, okay, uh, in, a, in a pleasant way. Well, there you go. Uh, I hope you, uh, that it, it works for you. Try, try this exercise. Try to isolate the intervals that, it's, uh, that are difficult for you and try to use this technique. And let me know your commentaries if, it, if it's good or not. Um, I'm going to be here for you always to give you tips so you can improve your singing and improve your voice, okay? See you, bye.